be at. Uh, so I'm going this week, try to improve on the little things that I messed up on in the game and uh, get ready for Texas Tech. What are some of those little things that you've pointed out so far that you can improve on, especially um, after a good performance this past weekend? Um, not just making one guy miss, making multiple guys miss and keep uh, yards after contact. Um, getting out faster on swing passes. Um, and just improving in the blocking scheme. Last week you talked about waiting for your breakout game. Top 100, is that your breakout game, or, or is that just still scratching the surface for you? Uh, I'm still just hitting the surface right now. I uh, feel like I could have a bigger breakout game than that. And uh, like I just said, I just got to work on the things that I need to improve on. You were closer to having that big run. You almost had one there. Is that is that what we're missing right now? Uh, yeah, definitely. I uh, feel like uh, some that's a part of my game that I got to display and show everyone that I can't break the 50 yarder or 60 yarder. So, uh, yeah. Do you want to say there were instances where you, you either a miss or a miss tackle or this you're getting close on film where you're going to break out one? Are you seeing that? Uh, definitely. Um, there's times where it's me one on one and it's up to me to make a miss and break the long time. And uh, there's chances, but I just got to capitalize on them. You were talking last week about Alfred and White making life easier for you guys in the backfield. Can you talk about flipping that, what what you guys do that, that makes life easier for them? Uh, definitely. Um, we bring down the safety, so uh, got to play 5-11, and 11, one on one And uh, like I said last week, I don't see anyone really guarding them one-on-one. -on -one. So uh, as long as we keep getting five, six yards of carry, I uh, feel like they're just going to keep producing, and then it gets vice versa where you got to put someone over top, and then the box is light, and that's where we get the big yards. You, you said you used to, in high school, carrying 30 or 40 times a game. Do you like this better, though? I mean, uh, the way they're using him in the passing game, and uh, is this uh, giving you more chance to show, show off the, the, the many skills you've got? Uh, definitely. Uh, I like getting out there, catching passes in the flats. Um, and I say, uh, Getting the ball 30, 40 times, that was high school. This is high school. Uh, so I guess getting it 20 times, that's fine. You always got fresh legs and always ready to go, so can't complain about that. Are you blocking more than you used to do? Um, definitely. Uh, you like that? Yeah, yeah, I like that. Uh, you got to show that. Um, if you can't block, then you're not the full back. Uh, so I like being challenged with the blocking. After sitting out a year, how are you holding up with the, the pounding or just like the stamina that you need for a full season? Uh, I think I'm doing fairly well. Uh, Coach uh, Mike Joseph and the strength staff, they got us all prepared for that. And uh, every week we're still trying to get stronger, faster, and uh, more conditioned. So I uh, feel like he's doing a great job of preparing us, and I don't mind it. Do you miss the kind of that contact you know, after sitting out of the year? Uh, definitely. Uh, I miss the being sore after the games and uh, all the little just being bumped up and uh, getting in the cold tubs and hot tubs to get yourself ready. So, uh, yeah. Uh, really doesn't mean much to me. Uh, I'd rather us win, then I could have seven touchdowns if we lose, then it doesn't matter to me. Uh, so I guess it's all about just us winning. That's all I'm worried about.